Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm Connections is finally here. And if you've been rocking with me since 2016, the early days, you know this game means so much to me. Regardless, can I start it with y'all real quick? Can I just get that out the way real fast? I know to some of you guys, this is basically Naruto Storm 4 HK HD 4K Plus, and you're not wrong. Holy sh... What is this? Like the anime? I'm locked. I'm locked. You got me. You got me. You got me. You got me. Damn. Okay, so these are not all the boss fights. These are like. Okay, I can't even tell, bro. This is so good. Ooh, ooh. Ooh. Sheesh. Sheesh. Okay, my mom's shaking. Oh, nah. You got it. You got it. You got it. I'm locked in. I'm hard. I'm hard. I'm hard. I'm hard. I'm hard. I'm hard. Woo! Hey, today I'm gonna do something a little special. I'm gonna be going crazy with the multiplayer and damn near anything in between with it. But until then, I do wanna get the story out the way. I don't wanna do a let's play, not at all. Not even a little bit boy because I don't have faith in this story mode and it's just not gonna be good. This is the in-between game. You got the main titles, Naruto Storm 2, 3, 4. And then you have the in-between ones, Naruto Storm Generations, Revolution, and now Connections. None of those have had good story mode games that I would want to waste more than five minutes on. But they do have boss fights. And I thought of something really cool. In combination with the new history mode, which shows every single fight from the previous Storm games in one nice little package, I want to do a boss rush. But in the end, we put them in a tier list to see what was popping to what was uh, average, exactly. I know it makes sense to start from Naruto first, but I wanna get the new stuff out the way because I I, I don't wanna judge it too heavily based off of the older things. So if I can have a fresh palette. I can go into this um, with a fresh mindset. In frame one, we get into a boss fight, right? Clash of the beast, the best. Oh, dyslexia. How did Naruto and Sasuke, the strongest? Oh, they're fighting right now. I guess this answers my question. I was gonna say how they let this happen. But we saw a lot of this if you've been seeing the pre-release stuff. Naruto is under control by the enemy, I guess. Sheesh! I don't know if this counts as a full boss fight, though. Because I don't think I've... I fully resolved this here, no? Oh! Oh! Okay. Oh, CC2 is just not missing again. They're doing their damn thing. I love it when they do that. Okay, Sasuke! Now, none of anything we just saw is going into the boss fight. Um, the boss fight itself, they have their own little uh, quick time events along with experiences with it with a different health bar. And that's what I'm gauging moving forward. So, let me try to do some of these uh, bonuses. I got a 20 hit combo I got to achieve real fast. I think I can do that. Ooh, maybe, may, maybe in a different way. This is my first time using the Sasuke too, so bear with me, bro. He's kind of, he's kind of sick on paper. Wait, is it, is it the new one? It's the new one, right? No, this is the old one. It's the old one. Okay, it was looking a little similar. Never mind. Hold on, hold on. I can go crazy with him. Wait, what's? Okay, that's the fireball. Damn, they took away my, uh, uh my, my little pool thing and the tilt. The tilt had a, a pool. Hold on, hold on, bro. Yeah, there was a mechanic called tilting in the previous Storm Four. And how you did that was tilting up the the ooh, the left analog and then pressing circle in a certain way. Now for most characters, um, they put their tilt in the triangle square being the second jutsu, which it, it, it's new. A little while to get used to. That's that's his new second jutsu. This is his first one. Oh, I can't even hit it, bro. I think we're done, right? No? Can I hit him? Oh my gosh. Yeah, now we're done. Cheers! Okay, I don't think I got the 20% um, thing, but I got everything else. Damn, I missed. Ah, uh, how am I going to miss the easy S, man? Can't hold back. Okay. I thought this would happen. Oh my gosh. That's a call back to the part one fight they had. Oh, no. Nah. Oh, this is going into a second battle. 
Okay. Uh, all right. Landed just you three times. Yo, Naruto. My duty. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. One more ninjutsu to finish that real quick. Where you going, bro? Don't do that. Oh, he's gonna blast me. Okay, so far this boss battle's not doing anything crazy. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, got the three ninjutsu. Okay, going in now. It's very easy. I kind of want to see if I can hit him or I can have him hit me to what I'm in awakening and see if I can do that too, but I doubt it. All right, he's gonna do some BS again. Oh, uh, now regular combos. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, we're just going to sub out of that Naruto. Oh my gosh, Naruto, please. You're wasting our time and my intelligence right now. Let's not do that. Okay, you're doing it again. You're not even hurting me doing that. All right, we're doing it again. We're doing it again. Hey, what are the other... Oh, hold on, hold on. let me check. Other objectives. What I see? Conditions? 60, unable. Okay, okay. I can do that. And they said I can't do awakening anyways. All right. See, a lot happens when you read. It's crazy. Woo! Yeah, you're just not damaging me, brother. You're just, you're just not damaging me. Take that. All right, one more, just because. Actually, let me teleport to you. Oh, that's annoying. I'm gonna dodge. Oh, oh, that's new. Uh, oh, sh oh, oh, oh. Go, 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 yeah! All right, that's kind of cool. I guess what I should do with these new ba boss battles is maybe not kill them too fast to see what other mechanics. I might have skipped that on. Or maybe that was supposed to happen for the low health. I'm not too sure. That better not be it. Okay, new cinematic. Okay. Oh. Y'all about to have no arms. We're doing this? Okay, well, Naruto's gonna have an arm, but Sasuke, you're done. After this first initial fight, the disappointment that followed was great. These, all of these are nothing like the previous boss battles in the Naruto Storm series. And I mean the QTE aspect mainly. So let me show you what a boss battle in this new section of story mode looks like now even though i have this opinion about the boss battles let me clarify that the story is actually pretty good it's just the boss battle quality is by no means what i thought it was going to be but uh i did beat it as you saw the s's um this fight is the first out of a series of fights and this is the easiest variation of this character um literally this is kind of really what you get until you get halfway down half health i think um it, it, i don't know i have a i don't know if a feelings though i want to say this but this character is kitted out but not in the game why would they announce they got an original character that we can't play with that's another gripe that i have off of just like a, a why but i guess money because this is for sure dlc phase two um basically in the other phases where you fight her it's just this but faster and more hits of it um, so it's, I guess it's a little harder to dodge, but by no means, uh, not really difficult. And I, I don't feel like I need to show it to you. You're seeing everything here just in a slower way, but yeah, not, not that she's cool. I'm not going to spoil the, the new story. So just know mid boss fight <laughs> mid, mid, mid. and, uh, we're done here. Can I get an S for good measure, please? Uh, ah, all right. On to the next one. Now, unfortunately. This is the final boss fight in the, this little new story mode and that I would consider a, a boss battle worth showing. Now, you would think because the intro of this started off with Naruto versus Sasuke, we'll get a full version of that. That that looks really nice, but you don't. You get a, a half version of that. That's less than what I showed you already, so no need to include it. But uh, in, in total, I would say the new story mode has three boss fights. And two of them just have multiple parts to them. Um, Murs is not difficult inherently here. But if you're trying to get an S rank, the third phase of this is a little annoying. Dodge these. I know some of you guys may be hating on the fact I'm playing on English. Uh, dub, not sub. I grew up with dub, uh, so I like to go half and half when I hear like the story. I'm weird. I'll switch it to sub later. 
but for a majority of it, it's going to be dub. Um, I, I'm not too much of a fan of Boruto dub, but it's, it's whatever, bro. Murder's not that bad. One more bar left. Uh, the story is really good. I, I I didn't really touch on it a lot. I don't want to spoil it, but it's 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 pretty damn good. It's like a really good filler episode. But we're good. Oh man! Oh come on, bro. You gonna you gonna sub it? You gonna sub it? Garbage! Come on, man! All right, there we go. Can I get ass? Oh. <laughs> I wouldn't have had to this part's a little bit confusing because I haven't showed the story, so I'm just keep it pushing. I have yeah, I should mention this is an Ochiha um, with benefits. Uh, this part, a little bit of a spoiler, but I'm not going to show too many cutscenes besides the final one because I feel like it's the chef's Former kiss to the boss fight. But Susano, a sick one too, because first time we're seeing this color for one. The design's not bad. Um... This is when it starts getting a little challenging trying to get an S rank, but by no means is the fight itself difficult, I would say. But with Sasuke and Naruto's support, it really makes this uh, a lot easier than without. Uh, one thing I will say that I forget with a lot of these boss battles is some of these go on mad long. Not any of these new ones, but there are some in the history mode I forgot about how much I dislike. Because damn, we'll get there. Let me get this first bar off you, Mars. Oh, okay. What are we doing? We're sitting back for our, our, our UDL. Mm -hmm, okay. Very mature. I think this is a uh, shooting the ground move when you just avoid it. Yes, sir. Okay. Yo, well, imagine if they have awakenings that are like this, right? Super armor and turns to a boss fight. Nope. That would be stupid. I'm sorry. <laughs> but hey, this is a cool concept. Maybe actually a, a proper boss rush as a game mode would be sick. But whichever. Naruto! Sasuke! Alright, good damage. Let's get halfway through the health bar. Uh, there's one thing you can do as well, too, with the big bosses in the newer story. Maybe in history, too, but you can you, you can counter them. Um, I'm not going to try. Hold on. Let me get that. Let me get that. Let me get that. Nope. Okay. One more after this. And come on, I, I do miss the QTEs. I will say that the, the difficulty is 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 uh, like I guess you do look for that in a boss fight, right? You want it to be difficult and fun. Can I say this is those? I don't know. It, it's something. I guess all of them together, I would consider it fun. But a QTE will keep me engaged, bro. I want to see the pretty cutscenes and feel like I'm immersed in it. That that's like the CC2 like bread and butter i think but anyways i don't think i have to get them fully all the way down to finish this i think maybe a few more hits and we, we're done the survey says survey bro please so there you go s rank two come on stop playing with me ah. mm, am i gonna skip this yeah Final fight. So he got his back arched, and that is what we call a part three. Same Susano, he's just horny. <laughs> um, yeah, I, I don't know. One thing about this little story, I, I would really like for it to be a semblance of real. One thing I hate with filler episodes, I hate when they connect. A, like, and I wouldn't say connect, but when they have a character realize something that's like very important to the story, I guess. Like, like something that's hard to fake when you put it together with a canon episode. Like one aspect in this uh, that I'm that I'm really referencing is Naruto learns a lot about what Naruto went through, but I don't think he ever actually learned what he went through in in the show that's canon. I wish that crossed over because some of the things that he's on, bro, I need him to realize like how good he he, he has it. Let me dodge this. Yeah, this is an annoying fight to get an S rank on a little bit. I think that the amount of health that you need is like damn near getting touched once. Anything past a, a one touch is an A rank. So as you can see, I'm definitely not trying to go for that. I'm trying to kill him as fast as possible using my subs and getting hit along the way. These swipes, honestly, I kind of want to retry because I'm getting hit by too much of them. But you know, it's fine. I, <laughs> the swipes are something that you just really got to look out for and just back up. I'm really fighting this like my brain's on my knees, bro. So it just is what it is. I'm going to let this rock. What's this? Okay. 
I'm just gonna shoot him on the ground. Uh, as you can see, this is like a lot of what was in the first phase, right? That is the same thing that the other fight kind of had going. It's like the same thing, but stronger. That, that's like the theme of these boss battles. But that's good and bad. If you like that or not, that's just what it is. Oh, this. And there's the counter. Yeah, I got him. Ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my gosh. Why? Why? Oh, my God. I couldn't get it again. All right. But I think. Yeah, I think he's done here. No, I actually got to get him all the way down. This is the final, final fight. Uh. Okay. Avoid these. Go in. Rasengan. And then Naruto Sasuke, one of you killed. Thank you. Thank you. Now, the ending is something you probably won't understand fully, obviously. Um, but you don't need to. This cannot be. They're overpowering me. It's cool, so I'm showing it. And it's not the true ending either, so. God, who will create a new age. Hmm. It's impossible. I won't accept it. Can I say the Susano was such a stupid concept? Like that the big gigantic thing, bruh. It should have been armor relative to like a human size. That would have been sick. Yeah, right. <sighs> such a crazy concept. Naruto and Sasuke being way stronger than this dude. Letting Baruto be like center stage. I get it. The show where it's at now is focusing on Baruto, but let's be for real. That's good. Ah, sick. That's CC2 cooking. I opened a hole. Here we go, stupid ass, bro. They they do Sasuke so dirty within Baruto. When he got older, you would think he would be more cracked. Always running the chakra. Always falling on the ground for some reason. Don't you get it? People create errors. Mm, time time to talk to him. Stupid selfish gods. That's like God. Duh, shout out the pain reference. See, a, a mashing circle right there would have been fire, but the cutscene's still cool. Hey, bruh. Underestimate. Talk to him. Yeah, he witnessed all that, so it's like he's taking in consideration. Talk to him, talk to Kitty! The pain reference going crazy. Now, as a parent, how do you beat his ass? Like, if he did something crazy, you can't. Like, if Boruto told Naruto, I'm the man of the house now, you just got to give it to him, bro. Because how you letting him do this? You're building a monster. Pretty cool end. Well to the boss fight anyways. Now, I know I did mention the previous fight was the final boss fight in the Baruto story thing, but this is actually the final, final fight. This is more of the secret boss fight. Without context, this fight looks mad goofy because just fighting Ochiha Clan A, the members, like random, random who's. But um, yeah, with context is pretty sick. This boss fight is not hard at all though. Another reason why I don't even consider this a boss fight. Uh, there's one though, one we're saying, let me get another one in. Oh, fireball time. Let me get out the way. You can just really just come up to the side of them, just do this. <laughs> it is not hard. It's laughably easy for a secret boss fight as well. I mean, Storm isn't really known for difficult like AI things or computer fights, but I don't know. I was maybe something would have been cool. I got a little bit of oomph. But anyways, let me hit that. Get my chakra, come back for some more. All in all, I would say if I were to rate this story, uh, I would give it a good little seven. Good little seven. 
probably one of the better fillers in Borrow. So that's how I feel about it. That's how I feel about it. Also, one thing I want to add, this game is 100% a confirmation we're getting Storm 5 eventually. It, it, Storm 4 felt like an ending. And it was obviously supposed to end there because we didn't get another Storm game for seven years. The biggest, longest gap we've had yet. Um, this is just an open-ended feeling game. But uh, there's another portion of this fight, a part two. But the part two is literally the same concept of the other character I showed, like the little girl. It's the same thing, just faster, not harder. It, yeah, I'm going to skip it. Now, we're getting to the good stuff. The actual boss battles. It, it's hard to really not go too crazy critiquing negative the other stuff we just played when you got this. Like how you peak in PS3 era days and you and you don't hit it again in the PS5 era days. Make it make sense. Yes, we're playing the first uh, major boss fight, I guess you can say. And um, Naruto Storm 1, when you fight Gara. Oh, this, shit, this fight was so cool. Uh, hold on, let me avoid this. This is one of my favorite fights of all time because as a kid I played I played this so much bro I don't know why I liked it you know what it was at the time there was another version of uh, this fight that was pretty good in a game called Rise of a Ninja Xbox 360 game and I like that game I like that boss fight in that game a lot but then when I played this I'm like yo it doesn't even compete I was bro I was I was fanned out it was so cool to me and ever since then it was it was it was love on sight with the storm series but it, it, this is gonna take a little bit. <laughs> that that is one common thing that I've learned that these big boss battles got, and um the Storm series is they look cool, but you're gonna be swinging on a subpar difficult enemy for quite some time. So get comfortable. Uh, one thing I guess is worth mentioning in Storm One, as some of you may know. Um, the subsystem isn't like how this game is. And same with the combos as well, too. The combos that you actually had fighting Shikaku were a lot longer. And I believe they probably did more damage for that reason, too. Different damage scaling. So this is like a a weird version of it because they're putting mechanics that the game had nothing close to it then. But we're definitely not almost done. That's the sad part. <laughs> oh, I lied. Oh, QTEs? My fault, my fault, gang. Yeah, these. Oh, we back, we back, bro. I don't even care for QTs in most games, but it, it got to be a thing in Storm. Lock in. No. Uh, I can't tell. If this looks better or barely any different than the original Storm. Uh -uh. No, you don't. Uh -uh. One thing that I wish they added this, even to this Naruto specifically, it was like a pseudo form he had when he fought Neji, if you remember, where he used like a small version of the Ninetales energy. I thought that was so cool when the show did that, but no game has ever like implemented. No, no, maybe, maybe the original Ultimate Ninja series did at some point, but I, I don't remember. But yeah, I thought that was so cool. One thing I don't find cool though with this history mode, there's a lot of boss battles that I feel should be in this that just aren't. That I'm a little confused by. My reasoning as to why they didn't add all of the boss battles is because they still want you to buy the older Storm games. You have all the major boss battles in here. What point do you have to go back to do that? But uh, I don't know, bro. Like they don't have the Jiraiya boss battle, which is insane. They don't have one I really was hoping they had because I wanted to play it was uh it was the, the legendary Sanin all fought Orochimaru Sanade and Jiraiya. Uh oh that oh bro, it was in Storm One and I thought they're gonna bring it back, but no. The the thing that they do with these boss battles are like a hand a handful of the greatest hits of particularly only Naruto and Sasuke. I think there might be one boss battle with a character not directly connected to them in here. I'm trying to remember what it is. Well, well, we'll get there. Anyways, one more bar of health left. I don't think we got to get him all the way down to finish this off. So I'm just going to wait until he knocks that off. Dodge this. 
dodge it. I dodge this, I said. All right, go in and finish the damn job. Yay. 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 That's not a QT, is it? Oh, okay. One more, one more session, bro, please. End me. End me out of this. Get me out, bro. I'm trying to see the cool stuff. Now? Now. All right, all right. Lock it, lock it, lock it. S rank two. Stop playing with him. Oh, oh. I pressed the wrong button. Ah, got my bunta. The the rise of a ninja game I mentioned did this portion way better, but it's fine. Toad blade cut. Yeah, because there was a point where he like transformed into nine tails and actually grabbed onto him. Ah, I wish I did that. That would have been sick. But. One mash away. Oh, hold on, hold on. Yeah, they kind of do the thing I mentioned with the nine tails, but he didn't have like the the fox eyes. He was in this version when it, when he did it. Uh, nope. Say good night. Ah. Uh. What a perfect end to an amazing fight. It's almost unbearable, isn't it? The feeling of being alone? Yes. <laughs> but I have people in my life now who are important to me. I care more about them than I do myself. And I won't let anyone hurt them. Long-haired Sakura. Hey, bro, I don't care what you say. The English dub not so bad in part one. Like, you're just gonna have to fight me. You're gonna have to fight me. I'm sorry. Ship it in. You can have it. Now this boss fight I forgot about. Uh, in the beginning of Storm Two, you, you fight Kakashi. Let's begin. It, it's it's a pretty cool boss fight. Boss fight. I ain't gonna lie to you, but yes. I forgot about this for real. I didn't I play guess. Storm Two ever since the first time I played it, so all that kind of slipped my mind. But Kakashi Sensei, not hard at all. Actually, he's so not hard. I'm gonna spam him because I am feeling a little racist. Rasengan. This is actually how I fought this. Um, uh, every time I replayed Storm 2 back then, I just spammed him until I he died, basically. But I'm going to just do that to get my little bonus for now to get an S rank, maybe to flex on y'all. And yeah, QT time. QT time. All right. See, why are you going to do this? That could kill me if I didn't dodge this, bro. Shut up, Naruto. You fine, bro. Now, can, can someone remind me? Did he end up actually hitting him with this in the show? I think he dodged it still, right? Nah, that was a substitution. Nasty ass move, man. That was too close. Now, if you saw Kakashi do that on Naruto in part one, and then he smelled his fingers right after. Would you still watch Naruto? Can you? Yes or no? Let me know down below. I feel like I could still I could still have locked in. I've seen Master Roshi do some weird stuff in Dragon Ball. That wouldn't affect me. I wouldn't I wouldn't ever consider him a cool character, though. I would get the police involved. But now we're in the second phase. Can you do it again? This this theoretically could be a little difficult if you, I don't know, play the controller upside down. I, I think on paper it sounds complicated interesting something in there but in actuality it's not that crazy um you can get sakura right off the bat to get him off of that little plateau but i want you to show i want to show you what this looks like water is bad for electricity right so you want to go on to the land to protect yourself occasionally he throws out a water dragon because he thinks he's he's quirky or whatever and um yeah that's that's kakashi for you uh, i think he does chidori sometimes too but uh yeah I shouldn't have wasted my Sakura. Yeah, you want to keep your Sakura held on for this moment specifically to, to knock him off. Yeah, so after you stay here for that, and you want to move out the way for the Water Dragon. It destroys the plateau, and now you just, you know, you, you just finish it, really. That's, uh, that's, that's the boss fight. <laughs> uh, let me know down below, too. Who's your favorite character in Naruto? Y'all know me, bro. Afro Senju. I, I don't want to spell it out for you. You're going to have to figure it out. Sakura! Leave it to me! 
when you do Sakura, knocks him off, and you kind of have to do it too for a little S rank. But yay! I think if I spam her saying on a few more times, this will be done a lot faster because I don't know why my combo glitching out like that. Bro, stop! Oh, I can't hit him. What is that? Oh, he's doing the dragon differently. He's doing story now. Okay, okay. Dodge. Oh, and the dragon. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. See, this is what I mean. Like, if if you're new to a PlayStation, don't know how to play on controller, this could be a tad difficult, maybe. But that's that's the only way I can see that. Um. Yeah. Same old dance. I'll get Sakura right now. Get him off. Stop. I think the water dragon's still coming though. And the fact that I didn't pick him off the ground is actually racist behavior. Um, I, you know my favorite character, but I will say my favorite Storm. You guys are. I'll save that for the next boss fight because I don't remember what happens after this. Oh, I get thrown. Yeah, I remember. Okay. Shadow Clone Clash. Shadow Clone Clash. How did Naruto go for like three years to train and didn't learn any new jutsu besides a bigger Rasengan? I just, I just think Jiraiya didn't really know anything. But all right. Now Rasengan clash. And Kakashi a real hypocrite for this because how are you going to yell at me for doing almost doing this with Sasuke? But you're just going to just, just casually clash with me with the Chidori yourself. Oh, that's sick. Ah, oh, that's sick. They got the bells. Oh, man. Did this fight have sticker factors in Original Storm 2 as well? I think it did. But that is that W fight. Big fan of that. Big fan of that. They finally got the bells. <laughs> I didn't think you'd manage you to great, take the bells. Ah, oh, so you sick. Too. I love Naruto, bro. Only if Sasuke. Oh, never mind. <laughs> All right. Go off, King. Now we're getting into the really cool fights. I I don't know where I would home. fit. Where I would scale this no one. But I played the hell out of this. Around the time when this came out, the amount of Sasuke fanboy I was, insane. Storm was the first game where you're able to play as the older Sasuke and Shippuden. Bro, I was all over it. I was all over it. In hindsight, I don't think this this outfit's as cool as I thought it was back then. <laughs> but back then, I'm like, hey, yo, I want that. I also have my titty out. You know what I'm saying? But on this. Uh, I, I think I think that's the main character I used back then too. Yeah, and the Akatsuki outfit, Sasuke. Yo, Sasuke could do no wrong. That was his best fit, best fit free. Only if he stayed in the Akatsuki. Oh, it's over. Wait, it's over, bro. I'm so used to the brawl so portions. I thought he had like a whole other round after this. All right, my fault. Ah, oh, so sick, dude. Someone said a, a take on Twitter that I kind of partially agree with that no anime game has looked better than Storm. I say partially because I think fighters fighters do be looking nice in the dramatic finishes or whatever. And, and Kakarot, like, come on, come on. Storm is still top three. Sasuke! Oh, and they, but how are you going to take out the part one Naruto and Sasuke fight? Boss battle. I don't think they did a lot uh, in that boss fight in Storm either, but... Oh, there's another part. Okay, my, my fault, my fault. What am I thinking? Bro, I'm like, ain't no way we're done, done. Okay. Yeah, if, if you know, like, in the actual show, this altercation was, like, so small. <laughs> it's cool that they actually, like, fluffed it out and made it, like, a big thing. Thought that was so sick. But not difficult at all. Now paying attention to how fast it took me to, like, destroy dude and not realize it. Yeah, this... This is gonna happen again. We just gonna look at the pretty pictures. Um, personally, I would say, because in all the Storm games, they made Naruto and Sasuke fight in some way. In Storm 2 and 3, a little bit of a reach, but I think my favorite Naruto and Sasuke altercation was probably Storm 3 on the bridge. Unfortunately, 
that's not in here, but I like that a lot. Thought it was so dope, all the extras they added in, bro. And I wish, like, because that was one thing I was hoping for Demon Slayer. Because Storm is, like, known... I might get an A rank. Oh, my gosh, bro. What's going on? Storm is known for adding in extra stuff that the, the anime and the manga didn't do. Yeah, I got an A. Wow. I really wanted that for Demon Slayer story, but it just didn't happen. Don't do that. Link. Oh, it's so hard, bro. I think it's safe to say at this time, Sasuke was significantly stronger than Naruto. He could have literally killed everybody who pulled up on him then. Did that wake you up? You're still a child. Watch your mouth. Ah. Fireball! Fireball jutsu! Homie, winded that back up. Ah. I got the call back to the part one fight. Jeez. Oh, it's so sick. Oh, that's hard, bro. Now I'll take you back. Ah, oh, it's so hard. Oh, I'm a fan. I'm fanning out again. Over. I'm fanning out. Oh, shoot. Sasuke! Yeah. Bruh. That holding hand thing was always a tad weird to me, but. Like, did they actually ever do that in the show? I don't think they did. It was just a random, like, imagination of them holding fingers. Like, what are we doing? We're really getting to the Disney vault with this one. This? Ah, S tier. S tier easy. Let's get to it. And I think in Storm 2, it was a little difficult. A little difficult. Mind you, Storm 2, how the subs worked in that. A little bit how it was in Storm 1. You don't have uh, like the four substitutions that are guaranteed. You got to spam it and you have a chance that it's going to take some of your chakra to sub. Because of that, you're going to get caught in more combos than, than normal unless you had a turbo controller sometimes because you can't just get out right away. Um, there's one cool thing that you can do in this fight. It's a bonus action as well too. Hold on. Let me let, me let him do it. We got a clash shuriken. Ah, we did this all mash. Bro, this is so sick. Ah, I love this fight, man. Uh, fun story with this. I remember I had a friend named Frank way back when, when I was a kid. It was the first time I discovered what a manga was. Uh, he had like a little Naruto book and I read it and I'm just like, yo, this looks just like the show. What is this? He told me that this fight was, you know, the anime. He told me what manga was, but he told me this was the ending of Naruto Shippuden. This whole fight ends after this. Um, yeah, when I got to this in the anime, I'm just like, oh, I can't end it so bad. Then, uh, there's so much closure. And then I learned he's a liar because the show just kept on going. To the roof. Uh, but but this is well, probably one of the greatest fights. Easy, easy. Oh, bro. This will be my last jutsu. The English hits, please. Put respect in the dub, bro. This is Spider-Man. Y'all don't realize this Spider-Man. Put some respect. Gone with the thunderclap. Talk to him. This is how I needed Peter and Spider-Man 2 talk to Miles when he had the black suit. I feel like we're a little bit too nice. You could have went at Haley. You could have dived a little deep into that. I saw a clip. What do you say? I can't even quote it. I'll get canceled. It's finished. <laughs> Finally over. W fight. Is this the death you imagined for me? Nani! <gasps> you really have gotten stronger, Sasuke. The craziest part been dead. is Sasuke ain't beaten this Itachi. Itachi wanted it to happen. Even with ninja now, aids, serious. Itachi still got that thing on him. 
He just decided to use it with his pinky out. Uh, Tachi is the coolest character, bro. Okay, I had this debate with a friend a long time ago. Let me know what you think. For the Who would win in a fight between Susano. Madara versus Atachi? And this is like Madara without the, the Hashirama nipple. I think Atachi is so hacked that he could beat Madara. I just think he has the capabilities to do it. Is uh, the feats that we've seen from him and his intelligence, it, it's, it's a little different than what we've seen a buddy, IMO. Uh, but but most people also go to say Madara because of just how he was described. So let me know how you would break that down, what you would think in the comments as well too. One thing that I can't do as I get older is debate about anime. So <laughs> if someone has an opinion that's so left, from mine with it, I'm gonna just let him have it. Oh, this. Oh, this fight's so sick. I'm sorry that, like, you know, I guess some of my. How I'm saying things are a little tad redundant. It's like, oh, it's sick. All oh, his hits. Bro, I, I played this so many times as a kid. It's just like memory lane. It's like a warm feeling. Like, you know, you know, like, uh, how would you like, you know, a food that reminds you of like what your, what your mama made, your grandma, or daddy, whatever you got. That's what this game is to me. It's like a little hug, a hug from the back from someone I like that so happened to leave me. Okay, let me sub. Let me get you this. Let me sub. Let me get you this. Why are we not done? All right, can I can I finish you before you hit me again? Cause I have no subs. Oh, I'm getting hit. Block. Oh, all right. Well, he's still done. Only two hits needed. Oh, you messed up my S rank, Atachi. Please. Look what you made me do. I'm stupid, I'm sorry. All right. Well, yeah. this part was so weird to me. I wouldn't say weird, weird's not the word. Disappointing. I wanted Sasuke to keep his curse mark. I feel like that was so much more promising than uh, the Susano arrow we went to. It was cool. It was literally bar for bar for what Naruto had. Why couldn't Orochimaru be his little Karama inside him and stay there? But this part, it just it just had to be weirder than what it is, bro. Messing up his his ninja aids. <laughs> And here comes Roshimaru bubbling out, just in there waiting. It's so gross, bro. And he's naked. Ugh. Finally, it emerges. The power of the he said it. Oh my it's gosh. It's either Atachi was ahead of the time on the pronouns, or he's just disrespectful. Bro, please. All right, thank you. My thumb, damn. I don't got it like how I used to, bro. I was a little lad when I did those. I'm like, I'm old. You heard my finger. <laughs> oh, shoot. Why don't I say like this is all new to me, bro? <laughs> This is it, Sasuke. Nah, then we got I, now, this depressing part. This is actually kind of scary in a way. What are you saying? Like, if I didn't know how this is supposed to play out, bro. Is there stop. anything I can do? Bro, just hit. Thank you. How can I defeat? This will be terrifying. You got limited movement. You can only move back. Ah. You can't hurt me. Ah. I really I can't. Do. I think I have an option to coming up in a second to throw something. Bro, please. I can't charge. I can't jump. There it is. I'm getting desperate. All right. I don't know what voice acting performance that was, but Sasuke don't need to sound like that again, bro. It isn't working. Well, as you can no see, it, the ninja aids is getting to him. Someone getting clapped in this matter of time. Oh, brother, please. Stand down. What do you mean? Do you have to stand? It's yeah, over. you can't even walk. Oh. My eyes. 
No, they're mine. Brother, stop! Yo, I'm, I'm really in the plot. <laughs> no use. My chakra's almost. At that point, you can't punch him. You just gotta wait. Sasuke. Yes. You. I am. <laughs> Do we ever know what he said to him there? I think. I think he said he loves you or something, right? Oh, he censored the blood. <laughs> Homie just put tobacco on my forehead. Your Big hopeless. brother, let's go home together. Why would you my foolish do something little brother, like this? Go ahead and hate me. You promised to teach me a new shuriken Sorry, Sasuke. jutsu. Maybe another time. Big brother. You're so far away. There's no duo like you and me, bro. This this, this converse. I'll oh. always be with you. Ah. Oh. The pacing of the conversation was throwing me off a little, but. Damn. Ninja aid strikes again, man. Hate to see it. Now we're at the finale of Storm 2. This stops now. Yeah. I think uh come. This in Storm 2, this fight was pretty cool, but we had a few variations of, of uh, Sage Mo Naruto, and in Storm 2, we had the worst one easily. I think the only benefit that that character had in that game at the time was he was an A tier character to spam with online, but that was about it. Everything else about him was, uh, was a little clunky. A little ass. Very ass. It was pretty ass. All right. I don't know why you're running away. Uh, I don't know why I'm missing the dash, bro, please. But yeah, this is cool playing with uh, newer mechanics. I feel like this is needed. I think Storm 2 as well. I think I mentioned it maybe. It also had another combo that they took out. There used to be a, uh, a right and left combo. Now there's only a neutral up and down combo from, from four to three. Don't know why they did that. But actually, it was probably because it was taking longer to get certain characters out maybe with giving one of the combo. So taking it out makes them come out faster. Look what you did to all of them. Stop crying. S rank. You. Not bad. Thanks. Are we juking? Ah! Are we blocking? Are we punk kicking? Double kicking. Can someone point out if Naruto ever did that hit ever with Sage Mode? That only happened once, right? And never again? Alright. You got your doggy. Can I pet that dog? Get back, kid. My fault. Link, link. Thanks. Thanks. Y'all the real OGs for real. I appreciate y'all. Yo, don't touch my toads. No! All right. That was rude. Personally, didn't like it. Shut up, Hinata. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Press and shoot again! It's oh, man. And he had like a two rest and sure he can limit with Sage mode, right? All right. I guess I'll die. Oh, baby girl. In the show, she just got straight pierced, right? But they made her grab it. For the game. Why? Because I... 
Oh, they don't even have her say she loves them. Power of the Nine Tails. This also reminds me of another fight I think they skipped out on. Was it? Wasn't there a boss fight with the fourth tail Naruto versus Rochimaru? I think there was in Storm 2. We just cut that out too? Oh. Well, yeah, this is a cool thing. We get to play as the fifth tail or sixth tail. Uh, it, it's very different than how the actual character plays when you summon them. Uh, summonings aren't really that fun to play in this game as, as others too, because they nerf the heck out of them, bro. The nerf said that this game did. We're gonna get into it case per case with the the rank videos I do, but it, it, it's it's drastically a different game. I can tell you the biggest nerf that has me appalled. If you've been playing for a while, you know Itachi has like a fireball that you can do in the air and on the ground, brother. That thing is so slow. I don't understand how they expect niggas to respect or even want to play Itachi anymore. They even took away his birds, bruh. I don't get it. But yeah, not difficult. Just gotta do a little dodge game. Go in, do a little five piece combo, call it a meal. Ah, 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 ah. All right, half health. It does get a little annoying. Is it here? Yeah, it's here. Yeah, so he's gonna get in a giant ball. And then before you can ever think to do damage to him, you gotta sit here for a cool minute and just and just chip away at that thing. Just keep on chipping. Keep on chipping. Keep on chipping. Not a fan. Not a fan whatsoever. But I mean, you're still playing as a nine tails, and I think that's always a W. I think that was like the biggest the biggest thing besides besides being a Sasuke fanboy is playing as like the nine tails. That was also a very cool element that I just loved in these games. It sucks, man. Like I we, we're just not gonna get something like this again in our time maybe i feel like jjk demon slayer have the potential to produce games in the same vein that had the same hype that storm did but for some reason it's just not it's just not doing it I, maybe it's just me maybe i'm biased to a degree but i'm just not seeing it bro storm is just an icon that and fighters i think those are the two long lasting anime game online experiences i've ever been a part of shut up all right and then kill him no oh he's i try to cancel it but he's not the same character i think i just i think i goofed the fight should be over like one more hit bro i gotta do this stupid thing all over again because i'm not a smart man oh he's done he's done okay there we go yep go in go in go in all right we're done we're done all right bro come on stop running that's right. This fight in the anime too is mad goofy with all the animation. Put me in the ball. I will not be sealed. Ah! So what was Pain gonna do with this though? Cause he said he captured the nine tails, but like. What, what was the plan after he was in the ball if he didn't break out like this? You gonna peel him out? You think he was gonna be nice and sleep, sleepy? I never expected this. You should have. <laughs> Blast or growl? Nah, same thing. Oh, don't roll garbage. The Nine Tails' power is magnificent. Yep, and then we got the cutscene that, quite frankly, Somebody. doesn't do this scene justice. But it's still sad. He meets Minato, and I think that's it. He breaks out the ball, gains control, and yeah, goes to the final fate, the final phase of this boss fight. Um, one thing that I did like with the Baruto segment is the the ties to this. This whole fight arc and pain as a character from the villain. That dude loved pain. Oh, yeah, you did. Come here. Uh -huh. That's a shot again. Bro, that was only one. Bro, what's our energy looking like?
Now, this is just crazy because how Almighty Push looked, it destroyed the village. How is like a bunch of people going to overpower it just by being people charging at you? I don't know, bro. The plot is really just a plot pain. You shouldn't have lost. And then after this, oh, the, the infamous talk no jutsu, bro. Now, as someone who watched this arc, do you like how it played out? Do you like how in the end, Naruto talked down to terrorists, forgave him, and things ended the way they ended? I mean, there's benefits, right? Like, we got Kakashi to come back, and who else? There's a few people that just died, right? There's a part of me that kind of likes the idea of them not coming back. Like, that would have been, been crazy. I don't think no anime has done something like that before with long-running characters to this degree. I don't know. Kakashi's a hard loss. That's, that's a hard thing for me to be like, I want that. But it, it would have been crazy. And talk no jutsu. Hello? Are you good? Did you? Pain? Okay, thank you. Oh my gosh. You lag and give me an S rank for it? What? An A, a rank? Did I, use too much? I deserve an S. Look at my health. Nah, it's not too late. You don't have a ghost of a chance. What does he say? Give up. Give up. No, not you. you first. Oh, they they changed his whole wording. You should give up. On me giving up. I oh, they still says it. Now we get into the boss fights. I don't really remember that well, but th this, this is a sick one. This is the first boss fight that we're actually playing in Storm 3 too, which I don't know. The third Okage versus the Nine Tails was a good one too. They, I, th that could have been thrown in here maybe, but uh, I guess that's fine. We locked. Oh, he's jumping. Don't do that. Yo, how do I hit him, bro? Oh, I hit his head. Okay. Hey, Tails. Um, I remember because at this point, I started reading the manga mainly over the anime. Uh, around the time where Sasuke fought Killer B is when I caught up. And since then, I just stayed reading. Um, I remember when Naruto got this form that he gets at the end of this fight. I was really hyped for it because, you know, I thought it was like the color of chakra. And that was blue. When I saw that it was yellow, I was so mad. <laughs> I don't know why. I, I hated it at first, but it took a while for that form to grow on me. But when oh and Killer B's dub, that's one voice I will never like. I, I think after this I'll change the Japanese because yeah, there's there's so many characters that the dub introduces or no, excuse me, there's so many dub characters I hear in Shippuden that I just can't do. I I, I feel like even if it's, okay, do I have someone who speaks both Japanese and English to a degree? Does Killer B's raps in Japanese, is it just as bad still as it is in English? Because it's unbearable in English. Let me throw that. Dodge this. Bro, Killer B. See, bro, I can't take it. Oh, sub. Killer B! Good punch. And the Nine Tails' voice was another thing. Didn't like either. Okay. Oh, we didn't meet Koshina yet. All right. So Killer B grabs this. Okay. I'm gonna miss you. <laughs> oh, we just lose Killer B for free. What? We're still fighting? Bro, what? I needed him. And now I got Buddy talking crazy to me. See, this is just not nice. <laughs> but it's still an easy fight. Um, like I said, I don't remember this too much from Storm 3. But I, I, I think I think I had a little trouble S-ranking this too. I'm not too sure. 
any any like big boss like boss fight in storm three and up when you're like humanoid fighting like godzilla it gets a little like uh, what's tricky the word paying attention to dodge certain hits when you have no subs wow. let me avoid that avoid that avoid that too and it's crazy too like around this point this is not even the full nine tails it's only like a half because Monato got the other half inside him. It's still giving him the business. You're mine now. Gotcha. And this is crazy. Picks up the whole damn fox by the tail and throws him back. That should break his back. Oh, heavy ass. Watch your mouth. Press hang on. Oh, 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 that's a new one. Don't like that. Don't not do not like that. Not so fast. I said, shut up. Press that shit again. Oh, wow. Big ball, big, big, big ball. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, yeah. So now we got the little summary of when Koshina comes. We can skip that. So now we have Koshina as a teammate, and he should be chained down. I, yeah. Oh, the night tells faces look suspicious and crazy. <laughs> do, do you do you like the idea of Naruto and Karma being buddy buddy like this? I I, I don't know. I, I guess I do like it because. I've always thought Kramo was cool, but I feel like Naruto is the only trope I, I, I can, I want that in. Like JJK, for instance, I don't know if you watch it. They got a similar thing going on with like Sakuna and Ichidori, the main character. If they dare ever did something like that over there, I would, I would hate it. Only with Naruto, bro. It's a cute little fox. Evil little Finnegan. All right, Koshina in a second, we should have Drop that ass down. Hold on. Drop that ass down. The Koshina farewell bit is probably the only thing that's ever made me cry in any anime. That that hit, bro. I, I, it was like my own mom. I felt I was like looking at it, like saying goodbye to me. Um, so it's pretty cool being able to have her as a teammate. OK, I get some chakra out. This is also an objective. I don't know if this does anything for me in the fight, though, like a buff or anything. Give me that! Keep it up. Huh. Um, but yeah, got that. What was I gonna say? I had a, I had a thought, but I'm, I'm like listening in between. <laughs> uh, I, I just, I don't know, bro. I lost it. Oh, 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 Koshina. I, I think it's crazy that they do have Koshina in the game fighting with like kitchen utensils. I feel like she got a lot described about her character to disrespect it like that. That's that little insane to me, but. Oh, three jutsu! I don't think I've ever done this before. This is new. What the heck? Oh, that, that, that didn't happen in the anime, though. Okay. It's needed. Buddy's going through all types of emotions. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. Time to end this. I'm gonna win. Well, <laughs> uh, okay. Here I come. Don't underestimate me. Oh, there you go. Naruto. This I'm coming, Mama. Seijo. Massive or Sangon barrage. Nah, I don't know, bro. The Nine Tails is just significantly stronger than Naruto. I just don't see how he lost this fight. This is a plot, a plot win. He might be a little slower, but I, I don't know. It's just not hidden. But the form is worth it. The form is worth it in the end. The final rest in Shuriken. Shut up. I said, shut up. Oh, hold on. 
Final mash, final mash. Mink it. What kind of power is this? The power of friendship. Nineties. Someday you and I. Get out! Naruto has a bad habit of befriending terrorists. I don't get it. You killed my family? We got a lot in common. Let's be friends. Like what 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 why? W form. This is easily the hardest boss fight to S tier in this game. IMO. And my favorite? Don't know. But it's up there. This was the first DLC that we got ever in a Storm series, and it was Naruto Storm 3 Full Burst. It was a whole little side game, I suppose, but it was packaged as a DLC. And that, I loved it. Oh my gosh. I remember back in the day, uh, the community was going crazy over it. We were speculating all different types of things because it was new. Like, like nobody's ever, we always talked about hopes for DLC for generations, never got it. Now we finally had it. It's just like, girl, what are we doing with this? What is this? Sage is, he's going to be crazy, crazy character. It, it's, it's sad because Sage Mode Capito and Storm 3 was so butt. <laughs> it was so terrible. But then they sped him up and made him so much better in Storm 4 and uh, onward. I think even Revolution? I think Revolution where he got a, a proper buff and then they just carried it onward after that. But yeah, W memories, W memories. This is a multi-stage fight. Um, after this, then we get to the real part that's a little bit challenging. This is an easy S tier here. It's just regular Gobbleto with little things in between. I'm trying to hit him with the alt, but I guess it didn't work. Yeah, and he had to switch to Japanese as well. Kabuto has too many cool facial expressions to be off lip synced in English. What now? Ah, this is all sick. Reanimation? Bro, Sage Mode Kabuto, if he didn't lose here to some dumbass plot, he he he's washing so many people in the war. I think he could have beat. Yeah, he could have. He could mm, I think he could have killed Sasuke and, and Itachi, maybe. Maybe. No, I'm lying. I'm I'm so I'm so drunk. I shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry. It, it would never have happened. It would never have happened. He just got some cool feats though. Well, getting into the second phase. Mmm. Oh, so hard, bro. Look at the pose. Shut up. Stab. Ooh, look at this. This game looks so good, bro. And this is where Itachi started his jutsu. Oh, no, he started recording because basically it's an army, right? Is what he put him in. It's like a loop within a, a point in time. And you can only get out that loop until you realize your true self, which is so stupid. But at this point, the loop is now recording. Those <laughs> facial expressions are so sick. Wait, stream attack? See, this is why I think Kabuto could have killed Sasuke and Itachi because this attack is so broken. And only he can maneuver in this. Everybody else is just hindered. Now, I know what you're thinking after this. There's no way he could win because look at Susano. He couldn't even break it. But hear me out. What if he has the power somewhere in there to break Susano? It's possible. Yes, Sasuke. 
Such, uh, I remember when this, uh, this came out in the, the manga and we were on like a break for a minute when Tatachi like started his jutsu. There was a lot of like speculation of what it could be. The end result of what this is is so stupid. I think a loop only break if you know your true self. Okay. Well, now we're in the second phase. Now this is just, uh, it's so annoying. It's not hard as a fight whatsoever, but there's just so many little things that could just hit you by accident, and then there goes your S rank, bro. Um, pass. Look my look at my health right now. If I lose any more than this, more or less, I'm getting an A rank. <laughs> I'm dead ass, bro. They're they are really strict with this health bar here. I don't understand it. But he jumps up here and starts spamming abilities he stole from people. Now, you see the bodies of these people inside him. It, is there soul in there too, you think? Or is it just like a husk of them with their powers? Because now I'm thinking about it. That's actually just like creepy as hell. Got the whole sound ninja just trapped inside his body. Okay, to the left. Avoid this two more times. And then I'm gonna dash at you. I just realized they copied this whole boss pattern in the Boruto boss. He does it three times in the same way. Like, what are we doing? But combo cancel ultimate. Uh, I think he's about to go jump up again. Yep. Yep. Now we got, who's this? Oh, the spider guy. Yeah, this is annoying. Cause you get caught and I'm caught in it. You're stuck and you can't sub can't block this next one either just gotta sit there and take it just gotta sit there and take it i hate him yep i got an air ring by the way i just want you to understand that it, it, it was annoying this took me like three tries maybe four didn't like it but we gotta add to the loop i think we're already in it hold on we'll see no we're adding to the loop yep yep yep, yep. i think it's the moment yeah here all right recording ends and now we're looping. Take the sword again. Don't cut that piece off. The, the anime, or excuse me, the game did this better than the anime for sure. I was expecting a lot more high animation from this little scene, but it just didn't happen. The war disappointed me a lot, to be honest. There's just so many moments I thought they were going to do crazy, but it was just okay. And he's just eating. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Run, run, run. Okay. And then. Okay. Okay. Probably like. Oh, I missed. Probably at least two or three more times of him jumping up there and we're done. Now, what I'm not going to do. Because I think this is the last fight of Storm 3. I'll, I'll, I'll talk about it when I get there. Oh, he's going up there. Uh, over here. Okay. Uh, okay. All right, let me back, 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 back. Stop! 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 Please! Over. Okay, wait for him to come back again. Dash at him now. And I'm, I'm in, I'm in there. I'm in there. I'm in there. I'm in there. Yes, sir. See, look at you, looking stupid. I can, I can finish him right now. Right now. No. No, no boy, no boy, no boy. Okay, we're done. Bro, he needs one tap. Don't do it. Don't do that. Literally one tap. One tap. One kunai and we're literally done with this. Why couldn't you just be finished now? Why couldn't you just stay on the ground and fight like a man? Oh. All right. Wait for the jump down. Oh my gosh, he's doing all this, all the, all the stops. Bring out the whole ocean. We're out the whole. Oh, I can't go. Oh, all right, we're good. We're good. We're good. Over, 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 over. I'm stuck. Now I'm stuck. Now, oh, okay. We okay. When he comes down, it's gone. See, like I said, bro, one tap. Why would he do all that? Hurting my feelings, man. I'm surprised they didn't get a B. That's that's nasty here. Circle. 
Damn, Sasuke or Itachi turned on the music. <laughs> You lose, brother. I'm sorry. Like, you can pack it up now. We're gonna pop out of that, cut him. Oh, what they did with the music was sick, though. Hold on. Did a whole edit. Nice little touch with his health being full. It does make you think. Kabuto knows Atachi's immortal. Why are you cutting him? He's gonna just heal. And why are you blocking these attacks? Oh, okay. Woo! You're looped, buddy. You're done. I'm sorry. Sasuke, what are you going to do? It's deja vu. I'm going to see you. Nope. Cut that off again. Oh, n wait, not yet. Then I take it and do it again. Now, at what point are you going to realize? Got a few more of this? Damn. Open your eyes, bruh. You're done. Sasuke, what are you going to do? What's that? This is... You're the one who got me to my friend. So crazy. I wonder throughout this whole process, which was probably like... Who knows how long he was stuck in here. How many times Atachi like broke out of out of the scene to just talk to him like that? Yeah, fight over. Now, for me, the video ends here. I'm not too long ago did a whole boss rush of storm four and everything past this point is literally storm four with a higher brightness and contrast and i don't think this game is too far away mechanically from what storm four literally is so it, it just is way too redundant for me to show those boss fights all over again if you want to see those plus the extra boss fights that even put into the game click the link in the description down below to see my little storm four boss rush but that is pretty much what the history mode entails. But thank you for watching. Didn't want to drag it too much. If you stuck through the whole hour video, type in the, the, the comment section here so I know you're a real one. And uh, yeah, let's, let's spam some online videos.